Welcome to my next video in my series on Wax 2.0, the free video editing software effects. Today it is not an effect. It is a um it's a fix to a problem a lot of people have been having and commenting on. It's a little small problem that doesn't allow audio. Yeah, that's that's kind of more than a small problem. Uh, today I'll be showing you how to make sure it works. Sadly, it can only be external. It can't be internal. You can't use audio with wax any easy way. I've been messing around with wax for a while and I still haven't found a fix for it. So, well, yeah. Let's just jump right in. You're going to probably be editing a video. Yeah, you're probably going to be editing a video, so... Um, let's import one today. I'll be using this video. As you can see, or here, whichever sense you use to detect audio, there was audio in that video. Um, that's what we're going to want our end project. We'll be editing that. Let's import it first, because you can't edit a video that you don't import. Okay, so now we have it imported, and I imported the audio with it. So I'm not going to be doing any effect, I'll just be running it through Wax so you know that there is nothing and we'll just render. Nothing for audio, I mean. Here you go. Creating video AVI. Start compositing audio. Start compositing video. Unable to read elemental data. Rendering over. Delete this audio. Then try rendering again. There you go. It seems to be working. I'll see you in a minute. I have a better idea. I will let that keep going, and meanwhile, I will open up Windows Movie Maker. You can use Windows Live, maybe. I've never tried it with this effect. I generally try to do something more simple with Windows Movie Maker. So today, we will import... Let's see... Right, you know that video you just um, went into Wax? and rendered yeah well we're gonna need the audio from that hopefully I just didn't go over it let's see my 021 we're going to want that because that contains all the audio from the video that we're gonna want the um, audio to be on meanwhile while well, that's importing and doing the little solitaire move woohoohoo okay now we have this video which you can see here is imported. Now Windows Movie Maker kills quality but most likely if you're doing it this way and you're using a free video editing software quality isn't that huge a deal to you. So as you can um, audio is working so that means in the right way we're gonna want to hop back in wax it is 66% complete good so now I can explain this you can um, turn any video any video into audio like we're about to do here room that is not audio as you can see there's no video and there's audio you can't really see there's audio you can hear it though what happens is um, when you import a video into audio it, audio can't carry video obviously but video can carry um audio can carry audio so it takes the audio from the video and just puts it right there so now we have the audio from the video we want and now we're just working on getting the um video from the video we want normally you have an effect over this but i'll see you in a minute i'll just pause this and i'll tell you when it's over all right i'm back it is um done and right now we have the video so I'm going to demonstrate that there is no audio indeed. Here we go. No audio. And that was with my volume on max. So now we're going to X that out. X that out. So we have our audio in here. And now we want to import into collections. Blur. Video. And now we have our supposedly edited video with no audio. 
And then we can just, just drag that down. And as you can see, it's the same timing. And now we will play. Here we go. Audio on max. Listen. It looks like it works. Sounds like it works. Both. I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching this. And if you liked it, please subscribe. And, well, submit any ideas if you have them. I really like ideas, especially the easy ones. <sighs> you know, I might just do it. So, yeah. Thanks. Bye.